Hey everybody. Hey everybody. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. We're Happy Heart Treasures and we're back from Kentucky. Yes. Um, we had a blast. Yeah. Five days we were gone officially. We left on Wednesday morning. We got back yesterday late afternoon, early evening. Monday. Monday. Wednesday through Monday. So we had our store on time away mode for five days. Now, did it hurt our sales? I think it did hurt our sales. It obviously hurt our sales a little bit. I think the fact that we weren't listing during yeah. that time hurt our sales. Well, that's like everything included, <laughs> yes. Uh, our next video, we do have footage from Saturday morning, Kentucky Yay! garage sales. So later this week, I will have a garage sale Garage sale picking video, yes. I guess. I did not wear the so. camera, however, we did hear the voices speak. And <laughs> I'm going to be wearing the camera some more. Yeah, we're so going to get the camera on Donna more. Watch. Because so. my picks are better than his. Her picks usually are. She picks more. <laughs> I don't know about better, but she picks more things, that's for sure. Okay. Uh, anyway, today we have, it is Tuesday morning and we have 32 things to ship out. Yes. 26 of them say they must be shipped in the next 24 hours. So let's go. So we got to get this stuff moving. So we already pulled the books and DVDs from upstairs. We'll show you like a stack and then we'll show you another stack later or whatever. But we're going to get to picking and get to shipping. Let's go. Let's go. All right, first up, Donna. As they say, if you touch it, it will sell. Yeah, this is, <laughs> I, we've been moving this, moved this around a couple times in the last couple days, and then boom, it sold for $25. What is it? It is a kit to make a little keepsake christening gown for a baby. I uh, see. That sold for $25 yeah. plus shipping. And Donna got that at a garage sale. Next up in box, LQ. LQ. And we're, we may be double dipping today because there's so many things. LQ. LQ. This is a tractor mailbox Love looking them. thing. Okay. We'll unwrap that. All right, this, here it is. This guy is called Dear Grandpa. And Dear it's Grandpa. signed Lowell. I can't read that because I don't know Lowell, Lowell Davis. Davis. And it's Grandpa at the mailbox reading a letter, and he's on a little Ford, Ford and, tractor. And it's sold for $36.99. Love that. All right. All right, we have two clothing items. Right here is a little pair of jean shorts, and that's sold for $9.74. And then a polo Ralph Lauren shirt that sold for $12. So that's it for the clothes. Next is inbox I. What you got? This is actually a Donna oh find. Goodness. Some Masters uh, Spectator Guide for 2019 when Tiger Woods was there, and that sold for $13.99. Nice. Came from a cleanup. We did it. Was in a pocket. We found. All right, box 48. A while back we had a Bose buyout for $50. I think this is the last piece. We've sold everything else, and in here. A bag, ooh, an empty box, almost empty. And there's two of these like speakers, and then some cables and stuff. And that sold for thirty-five dollars. I gave them a little bit of a deal. They it was listed at fifty. They came up from thirty to thirty-five. It's going to Canada, so I just felt like being nice. So we'll go thirty-five dollars. He's such a nice guy. Donna's getting box A. Oh my goodness! Reach for the sky. This is the one I filled up last week. And in there, you're going to find a set of seven embroidered what, tea towels. Oh, yes, these are tea just... towels. Guys, I found this. They had minimal stains. Most of the time when you find a tea towel set, uh, or a lot of the times, it has been used a bit. But this one is puppy dogs. Look at the puppy dogs. And I probably see there's a little little spot here and there, little spot right there. Yeah, no sold. But for not bad. Thirty dollars plus shipping right there. There you go. All right, let's do a stack of DVDs. The stack on the left. Okay. Uh, just grab the top one there, and that is Wings. Wings. Complete series of Wings. I sold for twenty two ninety nine. Okay. 
next. Next up is the complete series of park and parks and recreation. That's sold for seventeen ninety nine. Okay. And then we go to Yellowstone seasons one through four, and that sold for twelve dollars plus shipping. And then the Waltons. Everybody loves the Waltons. Everybody loves the Waltons. One through nine and a movie collection. And that baby right there sold for $35 plus nice. shipping. And grab that next one too. We'll do all the DVDs and we'll do the books later. Adam's Family. Uh, the Adam's Whoops. Family sold for $12 plus shipping. Whoops. Whoops. <laughs> Whoops, she says. And the next one's a DVD. And that is GSC. I don't know what it is. It's like anime or something. But that sold right there for $79.99. Wowzers. $80 for that one. That's awesome. What the heck? A Dirty Shame movie with, well, who's in it? Johnny Knoxville's in it. Tracy Ullman, Selma Blair, Chris Isaac. That sold for $18.99. And then we'll do the books in a little bit. All right, Donna. Yes. Let's get back to it. 72, box 72. 72. Probably about the only thing in here. Well, oh. it's in that box. There's two boxes. Oh, what, two boxes of them? Okay, four in each box. Oh. Oh. Fragili, it's Italian. Look at those pretty glasses. Can you see that? Hopefully you can. They're cores. What else can you tell me about them? Gold rimmed Coors. What's the date? Beer glasses, it says. Yeah. Uh, a set of eight of them. So four per box, and that sold for $31 nice. plus shipping. Frag Fragias. With no E, is it different? Fragias. I don't know. That's how they came to us. <laughs> um, N. LN, I believe, because it says Leslie. I'm not sure what's in here. Okay, in here we're looking for Nortaki. Lemon server, two nappy, bowl, dish, gold, gold floral, trim, something, something, something. How many words can you get in your uh, description? description. Uh, this must be it right here. That's right. That is a lemon dish. And it's got that raised gold on it. Never heard of a lemon dish. but And that nappy. She's fancy. She's fancy. I don't know what nappy is. Nappy don't mean the same thing with dishes, I guess. No, it's no, it's not a nappy in the afternoon for you. <laughs> All right, those sold for fourteen ninety nine. Those came from the buyout we did with the lessons. From our cousins. Uh, let's grab LV while you're in there. Donna is going to make me ship breakable things today, <laughs> and quite a few of them. Okay. This is a lot of eight custard dessert cups, six ounce, from Falls Graph. They're not that big, honey. That's good. They're eight in there? Yep. They're little. They're custards. All right, let's take one of those out. I wrap two of them together, so when you take them apart, be careful, because... Okay, well, that's not so hard to ship. No, that's not hard at all. Yeah, there's eight of those, and they sold for $28. That's right. Plus shipping. Plus shipping. All right, well, if that's not hard to ship, let's try box 38. Okay. All right, now we're looking for a lot of seven corningware cups. Mugs. Uh, sure, Ivy mugs. We'll get those out here. I feel like that baby is just looking at me. She is. <laughs> there you go. And that's it. So there will be seven of those, and those just sold for $14.99. Not high dollar. They're only going to Oklahoma, so it didn't cost a lot to ship. And corningware is generally not super breakable, so that shouldn't be too bad to Unless ship. Unless you drop it well, yeah. on the concrete. I mean, I couldn't break them. <laughs> All right. Oh, let's do something else broken or breakable. Box NN, not broken. <laughs> let's not do broken. NN. Can you get to NN? It's a mess back there. Not without fussing at you. <laughs> Isn't she beautiful? Isn't she beautiful? In her own way. Teacup and saucer. That's a pretty cool one, right? She is pretty. Yeah, that's pretty. Yeah. yeah, check that out. That's neat. Uh, that says Clarence Bone. Bone China. Bone China. 
So yep. if I'm England, that's over twenty-four ninety-nine right there. Okay. These are probably breakable too. We need box II. Oh, it's on top. I'll get it. You want to see why I'm mad at him? Look, look at this mess on the floor. How, <laughs> how am I supposed to get back there? Well, I got stuff to stuff to put in places. <laughs> you want to see why I'm mad at her? It's all these breakable That's things. That's not breakable. This ain't breakable. No. All right. Well, this sold. It's just beautiful. It's not breakable. It's beautiful. Careful. No, I don't have to because it's not breakable. It might scratch. Isn't it pretty? Love the Cardinals. These are two trays and they are made. It's Kuroke is unique. $31 is what it says. Yes. $31. So Weather pretty. permitting. Weather permitting. All right, next up, more breakables. I love you, honey. You're doing great. Yeah, this this one's heavy too. Okay, here we go. Set of four. They all just loose in here. What? Princess House Five Sixteen Fantasia mugs. Well, they they must just all be weren't loose. Weren't supposed to be loose. Well, they're all like individually wrapped here. So a set of four. So there must be like more than four. There's probably like a bunch available or another set available because there's definitely more than four here. Well, they're not huge either, so it won't be that bad to ship, honestly. So that's good news. Uh, yeah, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight more. So there must be like two more lots let me check here quick so we know it says last time available we may have to check that and make sure Are these mamas yes yeah. those come from your mama because she wants me to ship breakable things too <laughs> that's right <laughs> lots of breakables today that's right all right should we come over here and show things that aren't breakable yes let's do the books because okay. i won't break those all right i got three books first book $17.99 DC Comics Birds of Prey. This book is $17.99. The next books, there's a lot of three omnibus. Hold them straight up, honey. Omnibus ghost books, volume ones through three. And that sold for $79.99 right there. Nice. And it doesn't break. It doesn't break. And the amazing Spider-Man. This is from a return buyer. They bought another Spider-Man or two books. And they were happy with the delivery, and they bought this one for $35. So Maybe they're a viewer, so thank you. Maybe. If you're a viewer, thank you. <laughs> uh, okay. We got a, some more stuff yet. Hopefully not a lot of breakables. Do you but want to show your breakable? I have a new breakable. Look at you guys. Look what we got from some friends. Yep. And you know why we got this from some friends? Because our other friends say to us, what when we are out garage sailing and there's crappy garage sales they always tell us you got to kiss a lot of frogs to find the prince so that's what so we say he is our new mascot his name is fred fred the frog and just so you know who the princess is um the passenger princess i figured out that's what i am now because he drives me everywhere yes yes <laughs> Yeah, I'm the driver. Mm. So that's Fred the Frog. Thank you so much to Corey and Teresa, Grams and Pops Vintage. They found that, and we always talk about kissing frogs, and so they sent that to us. So that's super cool. He is so cute. Yep. All right, we have two of the International Santas then going out to the same buyer. So that's nice. They'll go in the same box. And one is France right there, and one is Poland right there. $7 a piece, so $14 plus shipping for those two. To the same? To the same person, yes. All right, next up, Donna, box E. This is a recently listed item. You're looking for a cake topper. A bride and groom is. just begun. Do you want to pop up the picture? 
I can just pop up the picture, yes. Pop up the picture. That is a cake topper sold for $15.63 right there. Uh, box B. Box B, we're looking for some t-shirts. Oh, they're right there on top. The Mo Vintage Montgomery Ward t-shirts. They sold for $30 plus shipping. I still have over probably over half the box of t-shirts to list. So we have so much to do. So much. All right, box 41. Okay. Uh, this is number 1035. It'll say 1035 on it. It is a uh, vintage Homeco Christmas Nativity. Shepherd boy with lamb. Somewhere in there, hopefully. Down in there. Doesn't look like it's very big. Pretty small. Nope. Well, that's a nope. Okay, just let me see. Jesus bust. Nope. This is uh, Shepherd Boy and Lamb. Owl pair. Box let me 74. See it. 1035. You said 41, honey. Told me box 41. Did I? Yeah. Oh, okay. Box 41. Let's grab the Scentsy out of there. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, we're looking for a Scentsy. And it's a full size electric uh, wax warmer. Celtic Cross. Something, something, something. Is this breakable? Yep. Wonderful. You are welcome. This is from a while ago. Yeah, this is pretty. This is a while ago. That is a Celtic Cross. Sensi right there. There's the lid. And that sold for $20.69 right there. Okay. Now we'll go the rest are there's three more and they're in the other room. 74. 74. Let's do 74. Okay, now we're looking for a little shepherd boy and lamb home co. Then 1035. Uh 1035, yes. Okay. Oh, he's so there. Cute. There he is. We found him. We found him. Alright, we we sold him for let's see eight dollars and ninety-six cents. He's been on for quite some time just because of the way it, we used to do the inventory tags. Yeah, we Donnie used to number them like that with that 1035 and Extra oh, work. Don't yeah. need to do that. Extra nope. work. All right, the last two things, Donna. Box 60. In this one, you have a vintage original BMF Schnapp Screw Schnapp Screw Girl Girl Girl. I don't know what it is. Pewter glass mini Stein <laughs> made in West Germany. It's this little sucker. <laughs> you have to pronounce it. All right, that little Stein. How do you pronounce it, Donna? I can't see it. How do, here, how do I'm gonna, I pronounce it? I'm going to pull it up on here. You tell me how to pronounce it. It's got the markings on the bottom. Vintage Original BMF Schnapp Schurgel Pewter. See? You don't know either. <laughs> Pewter Glass Mini Stein made in West Germany. Probably can't see that. Anyway, that sold for $9.74. Okay. And then the last thing, Donna, is in box 63. This? It is right there. You got it. <laughs> that is Mary Lou's Symphony Cone Yarn. Yarn! And that sold for $12 plus shipping. So that's it. That's all 32 things from the tractor. Books, yarn, DVDs. We start with breakables. We got a heck of a lot more breakables. <laughs> and But you can do it. Too. I can do it. I can do it and I can do it safely and it won't break. What are you looking at? Yes, I wasn't sure. <laughs> All right, hmm. I gotta get to work. Get to work. I, I'm gonna show you right at the end here. I'm gonna show you how all 32 things look when they're all packaged and stacked up. Awesome. Okay. Okay. But anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. We will be back later in the week for like def and subscribe. Yeah, definitely with a Kentucky garage selling video. But who knows what else we'll get ourselves into? Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. We're happy our treasure. See you next time. Bye. Three and a half hours, four hours, I don't know. I'm I'm slow. I overpack. I had a lot of breakable things today, which obviously added a little time, but um it doesn't look like much. But there's 31 packages there. One of them has two things in it. 
have not sold anything else since I started, but I'm going to pack those up. We're going to get those to the post office and move on to something else. Probably should list since we've been gone for so long. Um, thank you all for watching. Appreciate all of you, especially those that are still seeing this. Thank you.